Would anyone like some avocado toast? JK, but I am here to talk about avocados. These green gems are everywhere now on toast, in sushi, even in ice cream. Ice cream is nothing sacred anymore. Most people just drop dollar dollar bills and pick one up from the store like their college debt isn't waiting for them at home. But did you know there's more to this droopy fruit than meets the eye? Here are the most mind blowing facts about the avocado. Number one, love your cotto, thank the sloth. As if we needed another reason to love them cuties. Avocados need mammal intervention for it to spread and evolve. More than 10,000 years ago, that now extinct giant sloth was one of the few ancient animals that spread the seed by swallowing the avocado whole and wait for it, pooping out the pit. Thanks to them, it existed long enough for the Aztecs to start farming them for human consumption. Fun fact, the name comes from an Aztec word, aguacato, which means testicle. Number two, an avocado is a fruit, not a veggie. Did you catch it earlier when I said droopy fruit? More specifically, avocados are berries. A fruit is defined as the matured ovary of a flower. Oh God, what is this? 50 shades of gray. And since the meat of the avocado is fleshy and not dry, it's considered a berry. Very cool. Number three, it's easy to tell if an avocado is ripe. Look at the stem. I mean the protruding part at the top of the avocado. Try peeling it off. And if it's too hard to peel, it's not ripe yet. If you peel it, but it's brown underneath, it's overripe. But if you peel it and it's the perfect shade of green, then you've got yourself an Olympic gymnastics gold medal winning avocado. Number four, if your avocado isn't ripe yet, you can ripen it yourself. Just put it in a paper bag with other fruits like apples and bananas and seal it and put it away in room temperature. The fruits emit ethylene gas, which when trapped, ripens the fruits faster. In one to three days, your precious avocado should be ripe. Number five, avocados are so expensive. Why? Blame its popularity. And no, not only here in the US, other places like China and Europe are also discovering how awesome sauce avocados are. Darn it, I knew posting all those pictures of avocado toast on Tumblr was a bad idea. Well now, due to increased demands for the fruit, costs are up. Also because of inconsistent farming conditions in Mexico and California in recent years due to droughts and heat waves, they're making the precious Instagram food more expensive. Number six, avocados are basically champions of all fruits. This isn't even a contest. Avocados have the highest fiber content of any fruit and contains vitamin B6, vitamin C, magnesium, potassium, vitamin E, and folate. They also have the highest amount of protein than any other fruit, with one containing around four grams of protein. Avocados be swole, y'all. Number seven, avocados are poisonous to many animals. It contains a fungicidal toxin called persin that's safe for human consumption, but dangerous to animals. If your dogs and cats eat a small amount, it should be okay, but try to keep the pit away from them since it's loaded with persin and is also a choking hazard. Number eight, California California is king when it comes to the avocado. Around 90% of the nation's avocados are produced in Southern California. Who knew the avocado loved the sun as much as a sorority girl in Vegas? Number nine, there are actually many types of avocados. There are more than 15 types of the plant, but the most popular one is called the Haas because it produces year round and has great rich flavor. But another common one is the Choquette, which is produced in Florida. Well, there you go. Now you know basically everything you need to know about the goat of all fruits. Go forth, conquer. Just don't knock over the old lady at Whole Foods on your quest to purchase just the perfect avocado. Ah! There's enough to go around for now.